and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I have Paige's face up reveal just a couple videos back. I unboxed Paige and I had said I was going to try to get a face up really quickly to show you guys before the pre-order period ends. So the pre-order period is open until March the 28th or is it the 31st? I can't remember, but it's open to almost the end of March or until 40 dolls are sold. I did check with Fitz today and there are still some dolls available and with both face up types available so i wanted to show you my doll with this custom face up now i did decide to make page a girl page is a gender neutral sculpt so you could really do um uh, a girl or a boy or you could do uh, um, a gender neutral character i decided to go with a girl and you will see the face up that precious little lily did on her is absolutely incredible i love how she always takes such good care to like um tell me like open here carefully and stuff like that on the boxes you see she leaves me the little notes so that i know kind of where to open things but i am just really grateful um to get her back i've seen pictures she shared some in her stories and on her um, on her page. It says, I can't wait to see your page all dressed up. It was fun painting her for you. Thank you so much, Janae. Oh, and we got some, oh, look, this is cute. Oh, how cute. A little like Blythe sized or, um, Atelier Mimoni sized shirt and a scarf. That is really cute. Paige could actually probably wear this scarf. We actually were having like a cold, a cold um what do you call it a cold like snap here in south carolina it was like we had all our flowers bloomed and now it's freezing and so we have no idea like if the flowers are gonna die etc etc all right so here's Paige, and i got manicure and i did artist choice i just told her like you know do artist choice oh look some chocolate bunnies oh for Easter oh my gosh this stuff is so cute I got a peep have you guys seen there's peep is it peep Pepsi like Pepsi and peeps isn't that wild anyway okay and, oh and a marshmallow bunny oh how cute I will enjoy that a lot thank you very much okay and then um, so this is let's see um, extra gems Oh, so she did some piercings for me. She asked if she could do piercings. I was like, yes, do. I will. I told her I'll love anything you do because I always do. So she did some piercings on the face, but I think this first is going to be the hands. I'm going to show you those first, and we'll put those on so we can get the paper clips off of poor Paige's arms. And just the, the manicure she showed me was just so pretty. I just, y'all, I'm just so excited. Okay, so look at this. I love the way that fits um, Ace of Dolls sculpted the hands on Paige. I just think they're really well sculpted and shaped hands. And I love the way that Precious Little Lily just brought that out. Oh, she did glitter on like the ring finger. And she painted rings on, like a thumb ring. And then a ring up here. And a ring. I just think this is amazing. I love it so much. Just love the shimmer and the sparkle. I am going to put this hand back on. So I use paper clips to kind of do this to keep the, um, so let's, I got the hand on. I'm just going to pull the paper clip out. Boom. So we got that there. And now the other hand. Oh, I really love the sculpt of these hands and just having them. When you get a, a sculpt that has really beautiful hands like this, like, I really want to get the hands painted every time. And sometimes I forget, like, I, I'll get doll and I'll just forget that I want the hands, like, a manicure done. Even if it's just a, this is not just a simple manicure. She did blushing and she did rings as well. But even if it's just getting the fingernails painted, that's better. Look at this hand. Oh, gosh. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. I love what she did with her hands. They're just so pretty. Just, I really love the sculpt of the hands um on page they're just incredible so i've got this one in now and we'll just pull that out and if you've pre-ordered a page let me know in the comments which resin tone you got because i, I just think they're all look at that oh oh my gosh i love that we're just we're just to the hands i don't even have the face out yet this is so exciting oh my goodness 
I'm gonna put the gems back in this box that um, she sent. Did I just, I put a paper clip in there by mistake. All right, so now for the big reveal of the face. If you haven't, you may have already seen it. Um, I'm gonna put it in the thumbnail too, but you may have already seen it in her and Janae's Instagram accounts, but I still want to have the full like, you know, thing here for you guys. So, and I got, she, oh, she put her eyes in for me. I brought out a different set of eyes, but I'm pretty sure they're like way too big. I don't know what size they are. Oh, she looks so good. I sent her, all right, let's see. Let's get her unwrapped. She's wrapped her very, very carefully up to preserve this face up. And I just, I'm very excited to see all the future page parents and how they decide to style their dolls um, because it's just, Paige is such, such a wonderful sculpt, really and truly. Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh. And here's, here's how much attention Janae pays to details. Like, ah, okay. She, I told her to do artist choice, but she knew which wig I was going to use. And I don't know if she did this intentionally, but I feel like she did. She added a little bit of like that yellow to kind of like go with the wig that I have. Gosh, I, I just love her work y'all so much. I really, really do. I'm very grateful that she accepted my commission for her. Wow, just look at her. Is she not stunning? I love all the shimmer, the freckling, the amazing, amazing, amazing eye makeup, the piercings. Just check out the piercings that are done here. Just so gorgeous. This doll is so beautiful, so beautiful. I really love all the shimmer, especially on a fantasy doll. Like, Shimmer is so exciting. This is Waylon. I don't remember if you guys have ever seen Waylon before. He was a stray that showed up a little bit over a year ago. And I have a, I'm a sucker for dolls and cats. So here he is. He's still with us. Oh, this is when I, I think I had a hard time getting this. And I may have to, let's see. I had to use ribbon on this one. I'm going to have to grab some ribbon to do this. Be right back. All right, so what I do when I can't get, um, when the hook is too short is I use like a piece of, I'm using twine or I'll use ribbon and I'll just hold the doll. I'll put the ribbon on, move Waylon. <laughs> I'll put the ribbon on and then you can usually pull it up and get it into place. So that's what I'm doing here. So pulled that up, got the S hook into place so that the head's secure. Now we'll add the face. And I'm going to add the wig. All right, so here is my completed page. I'm getting her hair out of her lashes because I just had to wrestle with this wig. I'm telling you, wig wrestling should be like a, every doll convention should have a wig wrestling event. And whoever can wrestle wigs on the fastest on the most dolls be like, the show I used to watch when I was a kid, Double Dare, where like you had to do all these weird like things and then the winning family or the winning kids won. I can't remember if it was family or kids or whatever, but anyway, here's Paige. I'm out of breath because of this wig and putting the head back on, but isn't she just gorgeous? I think she's just beautiful. I love all the fantasy colors. I think they're so fun, but Paige is available in flesh tones as well. You've got the um, Fortune Fair and the Divine Deep if you want a flesh tone. And then you've got this color. This is the um, Oracle Aqua. And then there is a mint color as well, Mystic Mint. So they are just so, so beautiful. So beautiful. Gosh, just look. Wow. I'm in love, really in love. 
this doll is amazing and I just love the sculpt so much. So a big thank you to Precious Little Lily for doing the face up. Um, a big thank you to Fitz Ace of Dolls for creating this doll. I've got an unboxing of the doll and an interview with the artist here on the channel if you want to check that out. And I will pin in the top comment the link to bring your own page home if you want to do so. Um, just a really fantastic doll. Oh, looks so good with the face up. I knew the sculpt was really nice before, but you know how a sculpt just comes to life when you actually see the face up? I'm just so pleased with this. She is so gorgeous. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. We will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from Patreon. Lindsay S., Leah W., Doreen Z., Janice H., Mercedes W., Cindy K., Bear Sunflower, Diane B., Kelly L., Shorna R., Stephanie W., Jessica S., Ray M., Shalane C., Penny P., Louisa Snitnax, Marty G., and Lynn. Your support means so much to me and helps me continue bringing you great Dolly content. For more information on how you can become a supporter in this, of this channel, please see the link in the video description. Thank you!